they say beauty is in the eyes of the beholder and so music should be in the ears of the beholder too I have never come across someone who really appreciates the orchestra of the cicada or the music of the mosquitoes. However, I know babies who sleep to the lullaby of the mother. And sometimes I have seen people who go to sleep or enjoy the clicking sound of the scissors of the barber in barber shop. Or even more brutally to the sound of the drilling of the teeth in the dentist office sleeping to the lullaby of the mother is normal however sleeping to the clicking sound of the barber shop or the drilling of the teeth is considered abnormal such a situation happens or occurs in 2 to 3 people out of 100000 in the population moreover this condition which is pretty rare has a very seductive name narcolepsy are you familiar with the cartoon character snoopy which was made by charles schultz this mrs schultz daughter had narcolepsy no wonder lucy had a booth advertising the sleep study 5 cents have you come across that that was in, in 1960s long ago narcolepsy is an irresistible sleep attack happening several times a day there are additional features like hallucinations what is hallucination that is something you see even if things are not present in front of your eyes or you hear even if there is no existence of a sound or you can even have insects and or spiders crawl on your skin there is no real spider or insect but for you it is a real experience that is called a hallucination This hallucination is a major component of some mental illnesses or drug intoxications. However, in narcolepsy it happens without any of these things. There are other conditions also like sleep paralysis. Like before you go to sleep or immediately after getting up you feel totally paralyzed. There is another condition called cataplexy. That means from the standing or or um, sitting position you just fall down muscles lose all the tone that fall is not like a rock falling down it is a gradual like a tree cut and falling down that means usually there will never be injury to the person it is slow they can their sensory or mental status is very clear they can be falling down without loss of consciousness as fast as they fall down they get up in a minute or so as if nothing has happened in cataplexy there is another special feature it happens usually at the time of emotional excitement mainly for happy news like if you are a girl whom you admire a lot very pretty agrees to come with you for a movie that is an exciting news what will happen to you you fall down that is cataplexy usually narcolepsy starts in the mid teens even though there is another smaller peak in the mid 30s in fact narcolepsy is a condition where is there is a intrusion of rem sleep to the wakefulness see in our mental alertness there are different stages one is total wakefulness as we are now and there 
there is non rem sleep non rapid eye movement sleep different stages then there is rem sleep rem sleep as a rapid eye movement sleep that is where dreams usually happen now this rem sleep intrudes into the wakefulness like a herniation that is when you immediately fall asleep without no warning that is what happens in narcolepsy in rem sleep usually muscles lose tone sort of paralyzed except the muscles of the eye movement and breathing can you imagine somebody's muscles not paralyzed and what will his uh, or her bed partner have to go through all the punching and kicking that is avoided because the muscle paralysis in rem sleep that whatever happens depends on the dreams they will act out the dream why narcolepsy ever happens there are 20000 to 30000 nerve cells and neurons in the brain in an area called lateral hypothalamus those neurons die in narcolepsy dogs have narcolepsy too they don't have any problem with the neurons of narcolepsy that dies they are normal because these neurons nerve cells make two sister peptides called orexin 1 and orexin 2 these dogs don't have any problem with these neurons or orexins but their receptors where orexin act they have mutations in another difference between dog narcolepsy and human narcolepsy is dog narcolepsy is inheritable that means their baby dogs can suffer the same problem humans even though there are some family associations it is not inheritable it is believed this happens because some of the viral infections cause immune response in humans that antibodies to the virus can cross react by mistakenly identify this orexin cells in the brain for this uh, antibody thing they are viral particles too they attack them and kill them that is how we lose our orexin neurons myself being highly partial to chemistry i will mention two simple chemical compounds that are the cornerstone of treatment modern treatment of narcolepsy they are modafinil and amide and gamma hydroxybutyrate sodium gamma hydroxybutyrate which is a simple molecule they are useful for different manifestations of sleepiness and narcolepsy however cataplexy the falling down uh, after happy emotions they are treated not by modafinil or gamma hydroxy sodium butyrate but may by antidepressants does it make some sense if you like this video subscribe and tell your friends thank you